Hello there again folks. Um, today I'm going to deal with this uh, thing called My Lucky. It's what you call a um, uh, browser hijacker. Your browser of course being either um, Google Chrome or Internet Explorer, Firefox. And um, when you click on, on the um, icon to bring up your, your Google search, this thing comes up, my lucky. Now, this, uh, this happened to my, my wife with her computer, and uh, I've never heard of it or anything about it. So anyway, I, um, I set about finding out what it was and, it, and where it came from. And <clears throat> looks like it's come in uh, with a download as a, a bundled program. Um, could have come in with an email. You don't really know. But, and you know, as far as what it's doing, is it feeding information back to its base or, or what? Um, the bottom line is you don't need it. It, it. It's not supposed to be there, so you don't need it. So we'll set about taking it out. Now, with Google Chrome, the, the best thing you can do is you, you bring up... Um, your, your setting, like you, you're going to set, uh, um, Google, you know, click Google Chrome and bring it up. Now, it, it'll probably bring up the uh, um, My Lucky 123. Now, even so, you should be able to, at the top of it, where you put the uh, the address bar at the top where the HTTP where you put anything in there well put that in there Chrome what you see there and click enter now it'll bring up the page with um, all your settings and everything on it now down near the bottom you'll see show advanced settings click on that and and scroll down until you uh, see this panel here with reset settings section um, and basically all you do is click the reset button there and it, it will reset it at your Google and uh, my lucky one two three should go off into the distance removed from the browser that sort of will apply also um, Internet Explorer it's slightly different sometimes at the top where you um, there might be file I just forget exactly what the wording is file something and uh, I'll just stop it there while I had a cough um, and there should be file there we'll click on um, tools uh, and navigate down to the bottom until you come to Internet Options. Click on Internet Options and it'll bring this panel up. Now at the bottom of that panel you'll see here to reset your <coughs> Explorer settings just click the reset <coughs> and you'll then have to click the apply uh, and then OK and you should be home and hose there. Now yeah, with Firefox, <coughs> um, I, I don't use, and I haven't used Firefox very much, um, but you navigate to the Firefox menu at the top of the browser uh, and click on the help area. Uh, then click on troubleshooting information and when the new tab uh, will appear, uh, there's a section there in the upper right corner reset Firefox to its default state so there once again you click um, refresh Firefox reset 
right? So that's how you do it. And that's how I fixed mine yesterday, or my wife's one yesterday. All right, folks? Now, if you like these, um, these uh, different help uh, tutorials that I make up, if you like to click on the subscribe button, um, uh, every time I make a new one, um, you'll be let know that there is a new one there. All right? Okay, well, we'll call today, and good luck. Bye-bye for now.